Go ahead. But yeah, I mean, I, I, at the end of the day, man, they, they paid about fucking. I, I'm sorry, I don't want to be cursing. They paid about thirty thousand dollars to make that movie. Yeah, man, I, I think it probably was maybe two million. Oh. You said to me because you're paying actors, but I'm, I'm saying as far as I mean, else. but but the pr- production budget is actors plus the film crew plus the sites that you're paying people plus the dog. You got to pay the dog. All right, well, throw, throw, <laughs> throw, throw your money in, whatever. Throw your money in. But all they did was like go out to the uh, mountains. They probably were at a national park. It was at, I'm, I'm at Yellowstone, and they had like a camper. And then they and what just, you, you think you just built the house and, and built the, the church or whatever? No, they didn't build a house. They went to your house. They were like, you know, Blake. Oh, see, they still got to pay you for that. What? You know what I'm saying? How much? A hundred dollars? I mean, they, they ain't shooting my house for less than a hundred. hundred grand. hundred grand for like two days yeah. of filming? Hey. hey. barely in the house. I have standards. Man, that movie was Oh, poopy. you want to shoot in my house? Yeah, give me a hundred grand. Man, I want. you ever want to see a worse movie ever made? Go watch uh, No Holds Bar with Hulk Hogan. That was the only worst movie. What was, what was No Holds Bar? But Zeus, the black dude was Zeus, and it was Hogan versus Tiny Lister, and it was. Wait, what was the one? Suburban where, Commando. Uh, no, no, what was the one where he was uh, with the kids, and then he was fighting? Like, Suburban Commando. He no, was, one. It was like Mr. Mom or something like that. That was Mr. Mom. Suburban yeah. Commando. He was a he was an alien dude. He came down. He had the kid. I don't, I don't remember that movie. Oh, you just said it. That was the same movie. At the end of the day, man. That was a terrible, terrible, and second die. I thought, I, thought we were, I thought we were talking about Z for Zechariah. No, we're talking about bad movies. Oh, 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 we're talking about bad movies. We can go on for days. Hey, we go right on for days, man. Because, I mean, look, Critters, 1 through 50. Oh, gosh. And you know what the stupid thing is? I had a dude that played baseball with me. His nickname was Critter. And it, it came, Critter? And it came from the movie. He was little? No, he was big. He was actually, like... About your height, and you're six four. I'm like six feet. For those who are listening right now, did yeah. he come out of toilets? Because the critters used to come no, out. No, he of just looked. He looked kind of weird, and oh, and his weird. his parents nicknamed him Critter, and then it just stuck, and everybody called him Critter. Bad parents. Yeah, very bad parents. Anyway, bad um, Z for Zachariah. Go watch World World War Z. Or, I like I like World War Z. Or or, or uh, War of the Worlds or Z Nation, which is on Netflix. I know or, no, the Z Nation is uh It's on Netflix. It's it's uh Sifi. Sci fi? Yeah. But it's still on Netflix. Is it on Netflix? Yeah. I've never seen it. I don't know. And it's yeah. another movie called whatever. Just watch anything with a Z except for Zachariah. Because Okay. Go ahead. Go if you ahead. watch this movie, at the beginning of the movie, the main character, who is uh, Chiwetel... Uh, Mar- Margot Robbie. Chiwetel Okafor, whatever Margot name. Robbie. No, 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 not Margot Robbie. I'm talking about... Oh, oh, oh. Chiwetel... Uh, 12, 12 Years a Slave. Yeah, uh, 12 Years a Slave. Ch- 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 Chitete Chick- uh, uh, Yeah, or Chick- something, or whatever. Uh, Chick-fil-A slash uh, Iman Ekfer. He go to a library. And I actually think that was kind of close. Yeah, yeah, Chick-fil-A slash Eek, 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 He's from somewhere that's not here. But he goes to a library and he looks up a book and it says A for Adam. Well, he was already, that was like fucking 30 minutes in the movie or something. Right, but but, but the movie stinks, so everything (laughs) is 30 minutes into the movie. But he looks up the A for Adam and then, you know, Z for Zachariah. I don't never know what that really means in the movie. I don't have an idea. Yeah, they don't meet a character named Zachariah no. at all. And I don't think What's that Chris was a Ryan's character. I don't uh his name was like it wasn't Zachariah, I know that. Like it wasn't Zachariah. And I don't think that was her dad's name that told her to stay in the valley or whatever because that where it would be safe. And at the same time, they never explain what happened. Like why the apocalypse yeah, what, and everybody what, what died? Happen? They never, they never explained it. They just said they, they showed, they showed radiation. They, yeah, they were checking radiation or whatever. So you assume it you might have been heat? like a nuclear bomb or something. I guess I don't know, but they never explain it. Like there's just some kind of apocalypse that happened, and they're the only people in the valley. Is those three people? Okay, so what I'm saying is go mm-hmm. watch like Garbage Pail Kids and um, go watch the new Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Go watch Turtles 3, Turtles in Time. 
We watch anything, oh and don't, it would be better up, than don't, this. Don't bring up turtles and dogs. Man, anything is better than that. You watch the uh, the Muppet movie with the little whistling dude that I hated. You can watch. Um, who's, the, who's the whistling dude? Exactly. You can watch anything, and it would be better than this. Muppet, the new Muppets. What? Uh, oh, the new Muppet show? Not no, no, the new Muppet movie. Oh, oh, not the most recent Muppet. See, movie. I didn't, I didn't watch any of the new Muppet movies. What? I'm definitely waiting for the show though, because the show is going to be. You didn't watch none of the new Muppet movies? Nah. The one with um, Jason Siegel or whatever his name, the Sarah Marshall guy. No, Brendan Fraser. The, the, okay. la- the last one that came out was, was with Jason Siegel. The, but the original uh, the one from... was with Brendan Fraser. I didn't say that one either. Was it with Brendan Fraser? I don't, I don't, I don't remember. But so. at the end the, of the day. Has, has Brendan Fraser been in anything in the past? Oh, I'm thinking the Looney Tunes movie. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say Brendan Fraser hasn't been in anything in a very, well, very the Looney long Tunes movie time. is better than Zebra Zachariah too. What what movie? Looney Tunes movie. Any of them? Uh, yeah. Space Jam. Oh, don't ever talk bad about Space Jam in your life. I mean, Space Jam was better than that. I mean, that is a, that is a classic of my childhood. Who framed Roger Rabbit was better. <sighs> the remake of Red Dawn was better than uh, Zebra Zachariah. Uh, w for Bush is better than Z for Zachariah. And so was uh, Crush Groove. I don't know. Just think any more. Uh, breaking 1. Make breaking, him a movie. Breaking 2. Make him a movie. Boogaloo. My Left Foot. Um, Simon Goes to Camp. The Man with One Red Shoe. Was that a movie? I think it was. I don't J- remember. J- Jameson Likes Girls. Jiminy Cricket Comes Back to uh, Neverland. That wasn't the movie, oh, but gosh. it's no, better. Neverland. Uh, uh, Blackbeard attacks Peter Pan and and Hook, and they team up together and they fight him. Thank you for watching. Before you oh. watch, <laughs> yeah, we're we're done. I'm sorry. <laughs> we going to we we are very digressing. Yeah.